What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the video. Hope y'all have an amazing day as usual. If you're new, please make sure to like, subscribe, and always comment down below. Really, really helps out with the video. So today we're at Broadway Pizza in Patterson, New Jersey. I'm gonna do another food review because I don't have anything else to post. Um, Super Bowl's tomorrow, so I'll probably post a video of me cooking then, but for now, I don't have anything to post. I didn't post all week. Um, mainly just because I was busy and I really didn't have any video ideas either. So usually I like to be consistent, but I couldn't do that. So anyways, we got two things for Broadway Pizza right here. The food came out really, really fast within like five minutes. So super convenient. This right here, we got the cheese slice. Look at the size of this pizza right here. So for $3, this is the cheese slice right here. Um, this is like the size of a New York pizza right here. Um, this is like the closest thing to New York pizza you're gonna get around here. Uh, we also got the meatball sub for what they call the meatball hero. I always call them subs, but each their own. It's the same thing, right? <laughs> I'm not gonna get mad if you say hoagie hero is what it is. So this right here was uh, seven bucks. Seven bucks, which is also very big. This is a really popular spot here in Patterson. Um, very famous pizza place. Uh, anyways, let's give it a try. Look at all that grease. A little bit of flop action, but not too much, so that's good. Mmm. Man, that is good. This is my first time coming to Broad Broadway Pizza. I've been around here a hundred times, but never stopped here. I gotta tell y'all something a little funny about this place. So, I would say about two, almost, probably about three years ago at this point, I was walking down Broadway, and this girl, who was a, maybe a little bit older than me, she was either, I think she was probably a high schooler, but anyways, I was walking by and it looked like she was staring at me. Like, like it looked like she was giving me a weird look. And then I went back like, what are you looking at? So then she comes out of the, comes out of the, uh, John, and then fucking slaps me in the face. I'm sorry for cursing. I don't curse on my channel, but yeah, that was pretty crazy. Um, yeah, she slapped me in the face. Um, and her brother was like, no, 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 why'd you do that? Anyways. Needless to say, I wasn't gonna hit her back. I don't like to hit girls. That's not that's not okay. Anyways, look at this pizza right here. It's perfect. Mm. The sauce and cheese have a wonderful flavor. It's crispy too. Like it's a nice crispy crust. Mm. Mm. Let me tell you guys, this is one of the best slices of pizza you'll get around here. I'll tell you that for free. I gotta wait for that meatball sub to cool down. It's probably still piping hot. So I'll just let the steam come out for a bit before we review that. Anyways. Anybody excited for the Super Bowl tomorrow? I am. Yeah, I asked um, if I could work early tomorrow morning instead of in the afternoon when I usually work at ShopRite, so. I'm gonna cook some wings. I'm gonna make this dip um, with cream cheese, jalapenos, bacon, scallion, and cheddar cheese. But that's like, kind of like a jalapeno popper, but it's a dip. It's gonna be super good. Making nachos, wings. And I did my shopping this week because I know the store is going to be packed today. I, I have to work at ShopRite at 4 o'clock today, so. Mm. The undertone looks beautiful. It's a little burnt on the crust, but uh, sometimes that gives the pizza flavor, so. But there definitely are places that you go where the whole crust is burnt, but or the whole bottom is burnt, but the undertone is up to par. Mm. This pizza is so good, so crispy. 
Broadway Pizza gets a 9 out of 10. There's a few other good spots in the area. Ray's Famous Pizza in Verona. Mario's in Bloomfield. Dino's in Montclair. Mm. Crust is good. Alright. I'm the type of person that eats the crust. I think people that do not eat the crust are crazy. The crust is like the best part. Let me have that piece because it was burnt, but, <laughs> but yeah. The crust is so good. up right here let's give it a try sorry guys yeah it's soft Def it's definitely very soft i wish they would have toasted the bread would have been like nice and crispy but meatballs are okay sauce is good really cheesy. Mm. I'll give this a seven out of 10. Yes, you know. I'll be generous and give them an eight because it's good. I don't know if y'all heard in my last post, but I think this year the Super Bowl will be rigged. Now, I do want the Chiefs to win because the uh, the 49ers beat the Lions. I wanted the Lions to go to the Super Bowl. Um, but, yeah, uh, San Francisco beat them by, like, just a little bit. And it's funny, the Lions were winning the whole game. But that was two weeks ago. So now I got to go for the Chiefs. Um, I'm not just rooting for the Chiefs because of... Um, What's her face, Taylor Swift? Although I do, I have supported the Chiefs in most Super Bowls. I just like the Chiefs. They're good, you know? Um, it's kind of hard being a Giants fan because the Giants are never good. It does not matter what year, whatever's going on, the Giants are terrible. But anyway, back to the Super Bowl. So um, I think that they're going to rig it this year. I really do because of Taylor Swift. Um, now, like I said, regardless, I want the uh, Chiefs to win, but I still think that they're going to rig it so that the Chiefs win, just to make, like, Taylor Swift happy. And, you know, she just won her Grammy. Good for her. Did she deserve a Grammy? No. <laughs> I mean, hey, look, I like Taylor Swift. I think she's great. Um, but I'm not, definitely not a Swifty. After, like, a few Taylor Swift songs, she gets old. But she is talented. I, I, don't, I don't think she deserves a Grammy, but she's pretty talented. That, and Travis Scott definitely doesn't deserve a Grammy, but, you know. Um, J. Cole should have gotten a Grammy. Did he? I think he might have. I'm not sure, but, yeah, he, he would definitely deserve it. Uh, but, anyways, I'm not a fan of the Grammys, period. Just like Eminem and Dr. Dre, I hate the Grammys. Uh, huh. All right, so that's gonna finish up this review for Broadway Pizza. Overall, I love this place. I'm giving Broadway Pizza a 10 out of 10. I give them a 9.5 out of 10 and five out of five out of five. I love Broadway Pizza. I'm gonna come back here because this is good. That's gonna be for today's video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and God bless to all you guys.